no, 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 listen, listen. You must understand that tonight is a time where we are going to wrestle and go behind the veil. Say behind the veil. Lift up your right hand. I'm trying to stand a bit. We are stirring the atmosphere. Hey, hey, Kabuz Yata. Come on, somebody. Bacadia, 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 
Somebody lift your voice and lift up prayer. Uh, uh, somebody here tonight. Lay back on the debris. Lay back on the debris. Lay back on the debris. In the name of Jesus. Somebody say Jesus. Oh, God. Somebody say Jesus. Jesus. Because you need to understand when Moses came down, the Bible says, and, and the veil had to be put over his face. But by the inspiration of the Holy Ghost, the prophetess, uh, or him and mercy said, we are going, leave her to the case. If the veil was here, we are going beyond the veil. It only tells you that tonight, uh, 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 somebody is about to be plugged into the finishment of Calvary. Because the Bible says, uh, when the heart shall turn to the Lord, the veil shall be taken away. And the Bible says, uh, and when Jesus gave up the ghost, uh, in this Ukandiata, when Jesus gave up the ghost, the veil in the temple was rained from top to bottom. It was torn from top to bottom. Somebody tonight is gaining access. Somebody tonight is entering into glory, into power, into authority, into faith. Somebody say in the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. I want to hear songs and daughters of God. Say in the name of Jesus. Right now, I stand in the authority as a servant, as a daughter, as a son of God. That by the end of this meeting, whatever is behind the veil, that is for me. Because my heart has turned to the Lord. Every veil, every veil, the veil of sin. The veil of poverty, the veil of shame, the veil of disease, the veil of reproach. Tonight, if God be God, whose we are and whom we serve, right now, in the name of His Son Jesus, as we pray in one accord, let the veil, let the veil be torn, let the veil be torn. We gain access. Clap your hands together. Somebody gain access. My God, look at that. Somebody gain access. Bika tus ata. Zedebe de bakoa. Ranta dampaya. Zeke de panto. Ripa tuseta. You might be outside. You are not in the building. But the presence of God is not only in the building. I don't care where you are. God knows your problems. God knows your state. God knows who you are. God knows what you need. Let your voice clap your hands and begin to make declaration and engage the weapons of your warfare that are not carnal but are mighty through God to the pulling down of every stronghold in your life. Open your mouth somebody. Hey, Papa Tua Rabba de Bado Shakaya Risha Tusetete Ramba de Pa. Don't wait for a song. I want you Ramba de Tado Sekete Rifa Tus Ataya Papa Tene Seke Ramba do Setata Vigabu Sateria Vigabu Sateria the Gabu Sateria, Lepado Setanta, Razi Dizidi, Razi Zidise, Rempado Papa, Rempado Papa, Rempado Papa, Rempado Papa, Rempado Papa, Rempado Papa, Vakedita, Riaka Pataya, Riaka Pataya, Riaka Pataya, Riaka Pataya, O Kabe Sakea, O Kabe Sakea, O Kabe Sakea, in the name. Jesus. Face somebody, face somebody, uh, face somebody, face somebody. Uh, uh, I said, face somebody. Don't be too big for this thing. Face somebody. It says, and we, we, we behold us in a mirror. I like how the verse says, it says, we will be changed from glory to glory. Uh, you, are, you are facing somebody, but that is a mirror. Why? Because the person you are facing has Jesus in their spirit. And the word, the mirror they are talking about in that verse in Corinthians, is, a, is the word of God. We behold us in the glass. It's the word of God. And what you have now is the word. What you have now is the word. My goodness, I salute. Please give it up for the prophet Dr. Kofi Udro. Thank you, sir. And I thought you would lift your voice 
and anointing has entered the building. Libria to the city. Lepa da pasata. Ripadus akande de pa. Rieze de de pa teniapa. Are you here tonight? Is somebody ready? Let's lift up some prayer tonight. Uh, let's lift up some prayer tonight. You are facing somebody for a reason. And he says, we behold as in the mirror. Listen, the word that we behold is the mirror. And the person you are facing right now has Jesus in their spirit. And so as you are praying, uh, there's a change that is about to occur. By the end of this meeting, somebody will be changed from glory to glory to glory to glory to glory to glory to glory. Oh my goodness, to glory. Ah, uh, say in the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus right now. Say in the name of Jesus right now. My goodness, Sammy. Sammy. Uh, Sam, can you get the microphone? Stand behind some, some microphone. Say in the name of Jesus, right now, I decree by this prayer, as I stand in front of this custodian, as I stand, as I stand in front of this gentleman, this daughter of Zion, right now, my life is changing. As I pray, my life is changing. As I speak, my life is changing. Open your mouth, somebody, and begin to make declarations into the spirit. Right now, engage the weapons of our warfare that are not carnal. You will not leave here the same. I prophesy with my eyes open and not your party of the fathers in the name of the Lord Jesus you will lead here changed you will lead here restored you will lead here different wherever there were battles after tonight's meeting you will find yourself victorious on every side wherever there were problems after tonight's meeting God is taking over because we are fighting from victory not for victory it is already done it is already done it's already done. We are only enforcing what the Almighty has done. We are only enforcing what God has done. We are only enforcing what grace has enforced. Open your mouth, somebody. Clap those hands together and let's give God uh, some declarations. Uh, come on, somebody pray. In the name of Jesus. My last prayer point and I'm out of here. If you are, if you are, if you are honest with yourself, you know that the kind of victory you have to walk in as a child of God is not happening. If you are honest with yourself, you know that what the word of God is saying and the kind of life you are living you are not enjoying the victory that is in the word you know that your life is not showing for that power as the word of god has said it means that something is wrong somewhere uh, it means that something is wrong somewhere but guess what every time different anointings come together god is about to change the story every time different anointings converge in a particular place at a particular time it means god is about to change somebody's story I want you right now, uh, 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 at this point, forget about whatever, whoever is next to you at this point, it's for the next three minutes, for the next three minutes, I want somebody, just speak in the language of the spirit, and talk to God, between you and God, put that one thing before God, and watch God, uh, make you rise like Satan, does not exist, right now, just open your mouth, and beseech God, and talk to heaven, and let God take over, right Right now, from that's your problem, from your father's house. We will rise. Make that declaration and I'm out of here. In your name. I want to hear your voices. Adonai. You reign. Just sing, we will rise. We will rise. We will rise. <laughs> In your name. Adonai. Make it your.
your prayer we will rise we will